My name's Nancy Patterson. I have Graves' disease. I've had it for 20 years. And I have now learned that you can live with it. When I first got it, I just knew I was going to die. The first thing that I remember is I was driving in my car in Jacksonville, Florida, and my heart started pounding just you, know, you, could, you could see it, you could feel it. And I'd never had anything like that before. And it, it stopped after five or 10 minutes, but it was, it was very noticeable. It's something I'll always remember. And at that time I thought, hmm, probably better go see, a, probably better go see a heart doctor. It took me not very long to make the appointment and but, but my diagnosis was that I just was under stress and I should go exercise, and, and so that's what I expected to be told. I even made an appointment with a cardiologist that I knew would tell me that. She wasn't working that day. So I went in, had you know, EKGs and things, and the doctor said, well, your heart is fast, but it's okay. And he said, there's, there's a couple of things I'd like you to do. I want you to wear a halter monitor now, 20 years ago, those things looked like um, tape recorders. They were this big. And you hung it around your neck, <laughs> and you walked around with a tape recorder on your neck. And instead of saying out loud, I don't think so, I just said to myself, I'm not going to do that. And oh, oh, and it was come back the next day, and he'd run some thyroid tests. Well, I didn't do the halter monitor. I didn't go back the next day. So it took me another six weeks to get diagnosed. But that was definitely my fault. And then I got more and more symptomatic.